This is a posture corrector and basically what it does is it goes over your shoulders and straps into your back and basically draws your shoulder blades, draws your shoulders back and gives you better posture. But can this be used to help you play better golf and also improve your golf swing? This is something I've wondered for a while now and today we are going to find out. I'm going to take this out onto the golf course and actually wear it whilst playing nine holes of golf. And we're going to see, one, how I play, if I can play any better, two, how my technique is, if it actually helps improve my posture during my golf swing whilst I'm playing, because lack of posture is one thing that can really lead to injury with your golf swing, especially in your upper back, neck, shoulders, and really end up hurting you quite a lot. And this is something I've actually struggled with, which is one reason I got this. So far, I've only been using it to work at home, just working on my laptop. But let's get out onto the course and let's find out if this can help improve my golf. So, first shot worked out okay with this. One thing I would say is it definitely feels restricting, but in kind of a good way. You definitely feel like you're getting set up in the right posture, which is something I definitely find quite difficult. It'll be interesting to take a look at some slow motion videos and see any changes it has on my actual swing, but so far so good. By the way, it's maintenance weekend for my club, so the green's not looking great. So let's have a look at these two swings to have a look specifically at my posture and if this has helped me improve my technique at all. So set up with the driver here, and one of the things I struggle with normally is keeping my posture addressed, but this actually looks a lot, lot better, and it really does restrict your movement. As I take the club away, I do actually maintain my posture pretty well in the backswing, keep the club head nicely in front of my hands, taking it to the top. I do get a little bit shut, which is just a swing tendency of mine, and then on the way down, I do early extend, and lose my posture, which is just a swing flaw of mine. It just shows that this thing is not necessarily a miracle cure for bad posture in the golf swing. So now let's have a look at a pitching wedge I've got here. Again, setup, posture is a lot better. I have a tendency to arch my back too much and my shoulders get rounded, but here actually looks pretty good. Maybe I'm a little bit too over the ball, a little bit too much bend in the hips, but overall not bad. Take the club away really nicely, pivoting, maintaining my posture there. And I actually do a better job with my irons, maintaining my posture. And here actually overall looks pretty good. I would say there's actually probably a definite improvement there coming through after impact with better posture. Okay, so we're four holes in now, and it feels a little bit uncomfortable. It's starting to dig in a little bit. It's definitely starting to engage muscles I might not normally engage, which in turn is kind of making me a bit more stiff and sore, I would say. It also feels quite restricting, especially in setup and start of your swing. It's very difficult to get that feel and freedom you normally have when you swing the club but it does make things feel more tight and it'll be really interesting to see actually if it's helped improve my technique basically it's definitely not helped improve my ball striking it's definitely not helped improve my scoring not that i've scored badly but i just haven't struck the ball very well but this could be a really good training aid maybe to use to work on at the range possibly i think that could be a really good application for it <laughs>
having said that about my back being sore, I did just do a back workout in the gym this morning, so on second thought, that could be a factor. But I would say it's starting to get to the point where actually I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to keep wearing this for the full nine holes. I'm going to try, I'm going to persevere, I want to see how I feel after nine with it, how it's affected my swing from the beginning, from the end, so then I can let you guys know if it's worth using this for golf. Okay, finally a good drive. Let's take a look at this in slow motion. I started it just left of center and faded it back to the middle. Let's have a look and see what my actual technique was like there. So this is one of the few good drives of the day that I actually hit. And again, set up postures a lot better. Take the club away nicely in front of me. Keep the club face nice and square. Getting to the top again, probably a little bit short, a little bit deep. And into impact, I do lose my posture, especially in that lower back quite a bit. This is something I really do need to work on quite a lot, but check out this next drive I'm about to hit. Oh, this is really starting to dig in now. Definitely really uncomfortable. I definitely wouldn't recommend wearing this for a long period of time. It really, really restricts your movement and definitely starting to dig in a little bit as well. I think it would be better if it was a little bit more elasticated so that it helped you get that feel but allowed you to move a little bit more. after the round and what's the verdict on this? Well, I think it definitely has a value. I mean, it's only 10 pounds, I think it was, to buy this. So, you know, it's pretty cheap. It has its uses, definitely. I use it pretty much every day. And in golf, I think it can definitely help. I think it should be used on the driving range. I think it would help a lot of beginner golfers create good posture, get into good habits, because that's a massive, massive problem with a lot of people who start the game, who maybe don't know how to set up to the ball, who aren't getting into good posture naturally. So I think this definitely has a value, and even to tour players and really good golfers, this could be a really, really useful training aid incorporating into some other drills, working on different things within your swing. I think it could definitely be really good for golf. If you have a posture corrector and you've tried it or you've tried similar products for golf, let me know, I'd love to hear what you thought. Make sure you do like this video, subscribe to my channel if you aren't already, and comment your thoughts below. I would love to know what you guys think. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I will of course see you in the next one. Remember guys, grip it and rip it.